on this. I used to think that if you just educate people, like just get them a GED, and then maybe maybe if the government could um, get uh, uh, college funding that was cheaper or or something that helped more people into college, I was thinking maybe that would help our society. But I kind of don't think so. Um, I would say in, in that specific thing, yes, I think it would. Um, and to go off on a little bit of a tangent on... We're like, all about tangents here. <laughs> we just tangent. <laughs> That's what we do. You should just change the name of it to like, you know, some tangent. Uh, <laughs> some good tangent. Um, like looking at what I do, we look at this concept of pie, right? Not eating pie, although I like pie. Um, person and environment, right? So we're looking at the person. What's, the, what's their issue? What is their psychological issue? What is their, you know, internal thing that they got going on? You know, there's genetics involved. There's like their own personal history, but they're also in an environment, right? So um, what I think is really interesting is like uh, twin studies, right? So they'll take a person, two people with the exact same biological makeup, right? And they're raised in two different environments and they find that there's a lot of things that are similar, Right, but there's also some things that are going to be different. So when we have people who have the opportunity to learn things, when they have, when they're set up for success, like they have a proper education, they have adequate nutrition, they have a diversity of ideas that they're presented with. That's a more well-rounded person in general, and. That's like if we want to get into like big society things. That's where I think a lot of the um, the separation between the haves and the have-nots is not so much on what you have right now. It's what your foundation was. It, what was your opportunities going forward? If that makes any oh, sense. Oh, totally, at all. totally, completely. <laughs> it's a, it's a very social worky concept um, because you can only if you don't know that right. you have the ability to climb a mountain that's going to be a completely abstract idea for you. If you've never seen anybody do it, you've never seen a mountain, you've never tried climbing a hill, that's not even going to be like within your realm of things that you're capable of doing, you know? But mm. if I grew up near mountains and I climb them all the time, I'm just going to do that. And you're going to be like, holy cow, superpowers. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't know if that was a very good analogy. Sometimes no, no, I have it, really, really crappy analogies. No, I, I, I think that uh, that's totally good. fine. Hopefully uh, I'll just kind of repeat what I think I understood, but and I guess I'll tell a story where I think I spent a lot of my childhood um, between the ages of, um, geez, probably from f uh, seven years old. No, but, well, it doesn't matter. Seven, eight, or nine, somewhere around there, up till probably about twenty, where my br I was in uh, the the school that I went to was 99.99 percent white people so in my mind I spent so much brain power so much thought thinking how do I become like them how do I fit in how do I and I've told some of my friends that are close to me because I probably I wouldn't want to say this in an open setting because I would sound racist I say I wish I had the opportunity that you guys had because I felt like I wasted so much time thinking that when you guys had time to study chemistry, English, and get better on those things. Now, is it, is it my fault for dwelling on those other things? But it's just an environment that I was in. Mm -hmm. So they, they probably don't easily understand my, what's in my shoes. And even then, I probably can't understand what was in their shoes. Like they, they were my friends probably when I, when I was young. And they, I had certain opportunities to, to kind of like, be a part of them with them but yet my mind was still thinking about those things so i i i think i if that yeah if you understand yeah. that connection if someone has is lives by a mountain uh climbs that all the time i think i was living in a certain area thinking about a certain thing that mm -hmm. i couldn't be a part of sometimes so yeah well especially